Hello, dancing banana muffins. I'm Winter, and this is my ultra flat core challenge where I'm still looking for more gold because I'm not satisfied with the amount of gold I currently have. I need to leave my church, and once again, I don't remember where West is. West is exactly that way. Mm. How is the situation outside? Do we see mobs? How much black wool? This definitely is not enough wool for what I have in mind. Uh, but I guess that's not too important. Now let's try to leave this place. I hear a spider. Oh, look at the... Look at that house! And man creeper, spiders. And look at the slimes. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come on. Yes. Come here. I need to uh, take care of you. There's one more medium sized slime. There it goes. And leave. Careful, careful. Careful, there could be anything in those houses, so let's try to walk a bit away from them. Good. We have successfully escaped. And. Let me check once again. Yes, this is West! Hooray! How is your day today? I hope it's great because everybody deserves to have great days. Every time... Oh, <laughs> I was almost... Eh. No, you, you will not have my soul today, slime. Not today. Ah, so people would expect that since I had those uh, Ultra Minecore videos coming up uh, on my channel every two days, people would have expected me to actually upload more videos than usual because I would have those already up. I, I just need to make them public and uh, at the same time I record my usual things and I upload those. So that would mean twice as many videos as usual, but this is winter we're talking about, she doesn't do things the way uh, people would expect her to. And instead what I did was take a small break. I, I took advantage of the fact that I had those videos to make uh, public every two days and I took a very small break from recording. Um, I did that because uh, I will be honest with you guys, uh, two smithies, pretty cool. I will be honest with you guys but I have no clue what to do. My <laughs> my computer can't render videos anymore. It just gives up. If the video is more than 10 minutes long, uh, I have to re-render it. Uh, last time I had to render a video, it took me... It, it was uh, uh, ten, 10 minutes long, uh, 13 minutes long, and it took me seven tries, six tries to uh, render it correctly. It kept stopping one minute short from the end. <laughs> it was driving me crazy. Uh, I, I just I just don't know what to do. I, where's the other smithy I saw? Oh, hi, right here. I sincerely don't know what to do. I'm, I'm, I'm desperate. <laughs> uh, and what changed? Nothing. I just thought I had been waiting a bit too long to make videos, so I guess I'll see how it goes with this one. Uh, by the way, how much wood do I have on me? Well, I, I, I don't need more. I do need a little more. That's very creepy. I do need a little more. Oh, wait. If I wish to trade something with those fine gentlemen. Let's see if one of them has a good deal. Do you have a good deal? Oh, well, yeah, sure. I'll take it. Thank you. I'll grab more wheat. Uh, are you medium sized slime? Yes, you are. So I will be avoiding you. I haven't taken any wool. I shouldn't. I mean, I should. I shouldn't not take wool. And you! Ooh, cookies! Well, great. I'm leaving, I guess. Uh, yeah, I will be like. I don't know what I was saying. <laughs> Hello, slime. You scared the crap out of me, and I took uh, unnecessary, unnecessary damage. Unnecessary damage. Unnecessarily took damage. I took damage that I should not have. <laughs> you know what? This 
challenge here this series of videos is going to be about me running collecting gold eating the gold in the form of golden apples because while running i took damage and then repeating everything from the start <laughs> Um, I apologize for that. So yeah, computer problems and uh, I have no clue if I will ever be able to solve those issues because, uh, oh, you know, I still remember the day I assembled and bought this computer. Uh, not in that order. And uh, that was four years ago, I think? four or five years ago and by then it was the best computer you could possibly ever hope to get uh, I assembled it uh, uh, for the for the exclusive purpose of playing video games so it was a very fast computer and I was the happiest pre day of my life <laughs> uh, uh, I I really love my computer, it has allowed me to enjoy so many things and do so many things. It's just that uh, the way technology works, <laughs> it's not, uh, well, computers age too. And the, I, I, am, I am recognizing the signs of old age, that slime is extreme. Jump down, jump down! Oh no! <laughs> Um, don't listen to me kids, suicide is a bad thing. Uh, and yeah, it's probably going to be giving up on me any day, <laughs> any day from now. Oh well, if that will happen. Uh, eh. Okay, that's it. <laughs> now that I have uh, ex expressed my frustration and discomfort about my current computer situation, we can go back to the whole dreaming thingy because I left you with homeworks. The homeworks were to start a dream journal and I hope you did just that because if you didn't, well I'm not forcing you to but uh, you are missing out on awesome stuff. Uh, by now you should have a couple of entries in your dream journal, it should not have been too hard to remember a dream or two, even if it's just fragments, and uh, whatever format, format you recorded them, uh, it's fine either way, just have some words written down, or uh, it was, I, somebody in the comments of my previous video pointed out that uh, another kind of dream journal that I not, did not mention is uh, an audio one. Uh, Using an audio recorder to uh, say out loud uh, w whatever you remember about your dreams is an option too. And I will never stop saying this, you do whatever works best for you and you don't listen to anybody else telling you otherwise. Pretty cool, what's in here? Gold? No gold. I have so many saplings, I can't take more. The slime is worrying me, so let's... Stay away from me, the yikes! Today I'm taking so many risks. I am an extreme player. Uh, uh, another smithy there, I'm glad I turned around to take a look. So whatever means you used to, to uh, write down your dreams, I'll take the apples too. It's perfectly fine, and what I need you to be doing now is to either reread or re listen to everything you have written or said. Uh, because now we are. We will learn about the next step, that is step two dream signs. What are dream signs? It's pretty self explan explanatory, self ex that. It's pretty obvious what it is, and uh, this is what we're going to talk about today. Dreams are a giant collection of every single thing you have experienced in, in your life. Either things that you have seen, or things that you, you have heard, or things that, that you have felt, things you have thought about anything <laughs> and your mind kind of combines them in a way that doesn't doesn't really make too much sense and sometimes comes up with new things by combining those things 
But the basic concept is that every single dream, you, every single thing you dream about is something that you have already experienced somewhere in your life at a certain point, even if you cannot remember it consciously. And this concept, I can only sleep at night. This concept uh, can be used to our advantage when we want to have lucid dreams because it gets taken to us. Uh, good night. And good morning. Morning. It's taken to extremes uh, by the fact that uh, your chance of dreaming about something, a specific something, is higher if that something is something that you experience daily. Wow, so many zombies around here. So for example, I almost every single dream I have, uh, somewhere, somewhere in the middle of the dream, sooner or later, I usually see my own two, my own two dogs. Even if my dreams are usually not about uh, my dogs, uh, almost every night I see them somewhere in my dreams, either in the background doing their own things, or maybe I just go there, uh, say hi to my dogs, and then keep dreaming about <laughs> what, I was, what I was dreaming in that moment. But I almost always dream about them, and this is called a dream sign. It's a specific thing that you dream about uh, almost every single time. And it usually is something that you experience daily. This is the basic concept of uh, dream science. Uh, and every single person has their own dream science. If you start, if you have uh, a couple of dreams written down, you can start reading through them and you should be able to start uh, uh, seeing a pattern in your dreams. There are certain things that you will dream about very often, either places, situations, persons, objects, uh, sounds, feelings, it really can be anything and every person usually has uh, a couple of those. Uh, I personally have at least, I think, uh, six dream uh, specific dream signs that are very easy for me to recognize because I dream about them almost every single night. Uh, like as I mentioned, my own two dogs. What do you sell? Uh, Nate, thank you. <laughs> um, also, uh, ooh, more diamonds and some more gold. That was a very good chest. Thank you. Oh, I'm losing track of my own thoughts here. Uh, the things you, uh, your own dream signs. Uh, as I mentioned, are something that you experience daily, but not necessarily something that you see daily. Uh, I mentioned dream signs can also be something that you feel or think about daily. Uh, one other example for me is that I uh, very often dream about a specific person. Uh, that is my little own brother. He lives uh, very far away from me in a completely different country. And so I haven't seen him in years, and yet I love him so much and I think about him almost daily, and guess what? I dream about him almost daily. So even though I don't see him daily, I dream about him very often. So uh, my little brother is a dream sign just as much as my own dogs are, even though it's for completely different reasons. So yes, you, uh, uh, you are very likely, if you go to school, you are very likely to have a dream sign that is either one of your classmates, one of your teachers, even your one of your classrooms, or the school itself, or uh, anything relating uh, related to your school is very likely to show up very often in your dreams. Uh, if you go, if you have a job, you're very likely to dream about your co-workers, your boss, your workplace, any. You you get the you get how it works now. Um, so your next homework, <laughs> because I'm gonna give you a homework every single time I record one of my ultra flatcore videos. I am evil. Your next job 
is to read through your dream journal, listen through your dream journal, go through it, and start taking notes of what your dream signs are. The more, the more dreams you remember, the more easy the, your dream signs will be to uh, recognize. They will, uh, of course, appear more often, and you will notice them more often. If you get uh, two, three dream signs, that's pretty good. It's a very, it's, these are enough for our means. But if you have more, more of them, that's even better. Uh, why do we care about dream signs and what do they have to do with lucid dreaming? Well, that's for the next episode. <laughs> but in, I, I promise the next time uh, the real fun will begin. It will be where the whole lucid dreaming thingy will start uh, entering your everyday life. <laughs> uh, am I scaring you yet? You know, it's nothing scary, it's actually really fun. Still, now you know what dream signs are, you know that everybody has them just like everybody has dreams at all, you know that it's something you experience daily, so they should be pretty easy to recognize. And you know that for some unknown reason, I want you to memorize, to catch, recognize and memorize your own dream signs. Everybody has different dream signs and everybody has them. That's it. Now I'm going to change the subject just slightly, even if I'm still going to talk about lucid dreams, but there's something I haven't told you about lucid dreams that is quite important and I have no clue why I didn't tell you about this. I told you what lucid dreams are. I mean, I did tell you that those are dreams that you are in control of, but I never. That's only half of the entire thing, and I have no clue why I forgot to tell you about the most, the second most important thing about them. Um, I'm going to make a very short, uh, very short. Uh, uh, what's the word? Uh, help me, sneering white text. I can't come up with the right word. Thank you. I'm going to come up with like an example uh, to help you understand better what I'm what I want to tell you. Uh, so do me a favor right now and could you hold your breath for five seconds? You probably felt very weird doing that. <laughs> Just <laughs> do what I tell you to. <laughs> um, that's pretty cool. So you have been breathing the entire day, I hope. <laughs> you have been breathing the entire day without ever thinking about it. It's just something your body or mind did without you really being conscious about it. But now I've asked you to hold your breath and you did that because you are capable of holding your breath. And in fact, right now, you can even breathe faster than you usually do or you can breathe slower you can sigh, you can... Ah, life is beautiful! <laughs> and I'm going to get killed by slimes while I turn around my camera like that. That's a pretty cool thing. You are in control of your breathing right now, even though the entire day you have not been. So what exactly happened there that gave you control of your breathing? Well, the thing that happened is that now you are aware of your breathing. That's the village where I will be stopping for the night. You are conscious of your breathing, you are thinking about your breathing, and now you are in control of your breathing. That's pretty cool. You can do that even with uh, your eyelids. You can, you've been blinking the entire day without thinking about it, and now that I mention it, simply because I pointed that out to you, now you can close your eyes, open them in uh, just how fast you want, whenever you want. That's. It doesn't sound like uh, a lot of fun because uh, blinking, breathing, eh, whatever. You can control something that otherwise you would be doing on autopilot, so to speak. Oh my goodness! Run! Run! Oh, it's a bit too close. Um, yes, there's a church here. What is the cool thing about it? The cool thing about it is that dreams work exactly like that. I mentioned that lucid dreams are dreams you are in control of, but that is only a consequence of another thing, and this other thing is being aware of your dreams. The moment you know that you are dreaming, nice, 
and you're thinking about yourself being oh there's a smithy here being in a dream you would suddenly become in control of your dream just like the breathing thingy you haven't thought of breathing the entire day and now that you have thought about it you're in control of your breathing dreams work exactly like that this is what lucid dream is about you will be able to control your dreams the moment you realize that you are dreaming this is pretty important because it's the whole basic concept of lucid dreams you will have a lucid dream the moment you know that you are dreaming um, and how will we do exactly that because people are not aware of dreaming while they are dreaming it's so <gasps> People usually are not aware of the, te of the fact that they're dreaming because uh, just like they're not aware of the fact that they're breathing, you just don't think about it. That's not the way it works. Uh, you think about it sometimes if you get reminded by someone like I just did uh, right now. And uh, not golden apple time because I, I'm only missing one heart and a half so it's not worth it. I hope you followed the lesson. Remember, you have the job of uh, uh, checking your dream journal and learning what your dream signs are. And don't worry if you don't find any because you probably just don't have enough dreams written down and you will soon recognize your own dream signs if you keep doing that. And now you also know that lucid, dreaming, lucid dreams are dreams in which you are aware of your own dream. That's pretty cool and we will use this information next time. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next episode looking for even more gold. Good night!